I've been collecting mouse traps for about uh, 48 years. Huh. And I, I was in an abandoned house one time and I found the one here. This one right here? That one right there. Okay. I picked that up and we've always loved antiques. Before you know it, 48 years run by and a I've got a lot of antiques. Collector, huh? <laughs> <laughs> First of all, there's always kind of a race throughout history trying to design and perfect the perfect mousetrap. And so the very first one patented in America was it was patented in 1879 in New York. And since then, I would think there have been thousands of different different patents, you know. I would think so. Yeah, I mean, it's... yeah. Well, you brought a, a few really good fun ones here today. Um, you know, there's there's different methods of, of offing these poor mice. This is called the delusional mousetrap. It was patented in 1881 and there were nearly 50,000 of these made. I would like you to show us how this one operates. As the mouse goes in, it would step onto that plate. So then it closes the door in the front, so therefore the mouse then has an opening to go into the side room. Moving on over to this one. This would come and hook onto a small wire here, which is rusted. <laughs> okay. Once he was on there, the bait would be hanging down in there. He'd touch the bait. This would go down. Then, I'm going to pull this back up so you can see it. You can see the hole through there. He would go into that hole and start on his treadmill. It's kind of the ultimate live trap. It's the most compassionate in that, that he's got a little exercise workout room there while he's in jail. Then you, you take him down the road and you put you let him go away from your there home. There you go. And he, and no gym membership. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> he's buff when he's done. Um, over in here, this is a later patent. This one is from Germany, and this is from the 1960s, 60s. 70s. Yeah. As the mouse goes in, it's the same as the delusional mm -hmm. in that he steps on that pad and it drops down. So this would go down. He now is stuck in here in the little compartment. Okay, up the ladder. And go up the silo or whatever into this box. Once he's in this box, the bottom of that box would drop, resetting over here, and the mouse dropping into the can. This one is set like a, a fish weir. So it's a canning jar, and then this is soldered. The mouse goes in, and then at that point, he just can't get back out through the the through weirs. The it's a point. weird trap. Yeah. And then finally, we have this one, which we said earlier, which is actually a kill trap. And, and each of these blocks, I guess they're a maple. They look to me to be a maple. I guess and, so. And I think mm -hmm. they weigh maybe, you know, a pound or so each, somewhere in there. Right. Would you illustrate how you set that one off, please? Uh, here goes my finger. The mouse goes down. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Down it goes. So the traps that we have in front of us here are valued at auction at $1,500. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I picked the best ones. <laughs>